What's great about this and what say the Zooms of the world and stuff don't have is when we're thinking about becoming a level four team where you're embracing asynchronous communication. This gives you all of those tools in your um, arsenal of communication tools, um, enhances them, allows you to use them in a way that's a little bit more human and a little bit more personalized. How many times, I, you know what? I, 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 this was years and years and years ago, but I still remember it that I had sent a email to someone and they sent this apologetic reply back to me because they said, I am so sorry that you um, resent that, that information um, or, or what I shared with them. But you know what? I, I hadn't resented it. I had re-sent it. <laughs> I had sent it again, and and and, and you know that 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 little bit of difference really <laughs> changed that that whole email thread. And it oh been God, that's funny. So much more less complicated and unfortunate on their end. They probably thought I was angry at the angry at them, and upset. That's about funny the conversation, but it was just a matter of um, you know a little bit of misstep that didn't really come through over text, but would have been so simple in a video conversation. I think people, one, one thing that, you know, I've had to overcome this and I think people will have to overcome is really letting go of being perfect, you know, and, and I think the, the, the flubs and, you know, it doesn't have to, you know, you want to look, come across as being ridiculous or stupid, but, but just normal everyday conversation. Just make it conversational and make it authentic. People will be fine with some flubs and some ums and ahs. No, oh, I forgot this. Let me go back. Whatever it is, because you want to make it authentic. And I've um, really benefited from some some uh, customer service uh, um, interactions where I've asked for help with some software programs I'm subscribing to online. And the in the chat room, they just they send me this little. You know, 60 second, 45 second video just pointing out where to go on it. Um, and they say, you know, pictures, you know, worth a thousand words. And I think, you know, this tool will certainly uh, enhance communication if, if you can get everybody just to let go of that, that uh, perfectionist thing <laughs> and then be okay with it not being, uh, you know, you're, you're not on like, the nightly news, <laughs> you know. So. And, and, you know, at, at the same time, look, the, as you do it, as you practice, it's going to become something that's second nature to you. And if for whatever reason it's really not, you know what? Join Toastmasters. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Toastmasters is a great organization. I've been a part of it for years. Darn it. It's a, it's a great leadership yeah. and communication right. tool. Or you know, get, get a book on it. Uh, record yourself. Th this is an awesome opportunity to record yourself and watch your own game tape. Are you a good communicator? Are you clearly explaining what you're trying to explain to others? Uh, when you see yourself, when you hear yourself, you now have an opportunity to improve and grow. Um, so video is something that can really um, help you communicate as a team and as a corporation. Um, one of the ways that I use it is I use it in one-to-one -one sales video. So if you're responsible for making it rain in your organization, I love this tool. Um, you do outreach over email, people ignore it. You call them over the phone, guess what? No one's at their office work phone number anymore. Um, so <laughs> no one picks up the phone. But when someone sees a video here and it says, press play and you pop in, and you pop in their their name and you write you know press play skip and now i send you a video that's me waving and says this uh, you know what you know that it wasn't just some automatic yeah, thing, yeah. scammy thing it's a real human on the other end of that email who wants to engage with you in a personalized and humanized way um so you know our our engagement on emails and our reply rate and our open rate um, in a sales context have improved. Um, the amount of time that people spend on an individual website, on an individual web page, because we've got video on it now, and we've got an opportunity for people to convert on that video because we're using HubSpot and Vidyard at the same time. Or if you're using other similar tools, there might be some options there as well. Uh, but we're a HubSpot shop, so we use that. We'll upload a video 
to our website and then we can actually add a form or a call to action button right at the end of that video just the yeah. same and yeah yeah and you know and the thing i was thinking about you know, if you want to create trust with team members you know the best way to do it is with some personality right <laughs> and um if i can see you when you're talking with me you know i build that much better relationship um, and do some things that are cute and fun. Send somebody a thirty-second little, you know, a little thing that you're thinking about them. I think this goes a long way to building that that relationship with team members. If you're not in the same room together, absolutely.